This is JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Dean Perrine, and welcome to JSA TV. We are coming at you on location from ITW 2017, and I am here with Mr. Jason Katz. Jason is the CEO of Host.net. Jason, thanks as always for joining us on JSA TV. Thank you, Dean. I'm excited to be here. Outstanding. So how's the show going for you so far? Great. It's Very a good. great show. Good, uh, good meetings, um, meet, not getting in front of all the right people. Very good. Outstanding, outstanding. So um, um, I, I was thinking of like, a, I was trying to think of a clever lead in for this first question, but there really is nothing clever or funny about hurricanes. <laughs> um, and so um, we want to talk about disaster recovery a little bit with you. I mean, as um, hurricane season is kind of getting in full swing there in southern Florida, what are you guys doing to, uh, to help your customers kind of weather those storms? So, Dean, you know, the most important part of preparing for a storm is being prepared yeah. and preparing the rest of the year so when hurricane season comes along, you go through your drill mm -hmm. and you're ready. In the event of a natural disaster or any type of even man-made event, you are prepared to bring your data back and be up and running as quickly and efficiently as possible. Very good. So um, how do you help your customers do that? We sit down with our customers and we actually put together a full disaster recovery plan. And people don't realize until they sit down and start thinking about network tech connectivity, mm -hmm. uh, what type of office space will be available, what type of uh, communications will be available, do we have alternative computers in another location? Where are we backing up our sure. data? How will we access that data? Who's going to access the data, et cetera, et cetera? And once you put a plan into place, then it's practicing the plan. Sure. Sure. Um, okay, so um, let's talk about an ebook that you guys are, are, I think it's either just dropped or about to drop. You've got an ebook um, in the works, and I'm certain it's, there's a, a great deal of value there. Why don't you tell our customers a little bit about this ebook that they're going to be able to get soon? Sure. Happy to, Dean. Yeah. So this is just going out, and it's a way to really start to educate a potential customer mm -hmm. on what they need to be thinking about, uh, how to start to prepare a disaster recovery plan, mm -hmm. what it entails and how we can help them accomplish their goals. Outstanding. So how can they get the ebook? Is I assume it's going to be on your, your website, correct? It will be on our website, and uh, it will be available for free download. Everyone's favorite price is free, right? Free. <laughs> Absolutely. The best price available. Very good. So um, there's a lot of things going on right now as far as um, cyber security. I mean, security sure. is, is on, the, on the tip of everyone's tongue, even at, at this show where um, there's a, a, a number of different topics that are very, very buzzy. Um, mm -hmm. But when we're talking about IoT and we're talking about big data and we're talking about um, security, it all becomes infinitely more important. How is it that Host.net is, um, is helping their clients um, with a little bit of peace of mind there? So, you know, Dean, even the ransomware attack that happened last 24 week, hours ago. <laughs> and it continues yeah, to affect yeah. people. You know, people don't realize what. Uh, a, a true best in practice approaches to backing up your data, backing it up in geographically diverse locations, mm -hmm. having the ability to make sure that patch management is done on your software. They don't realize that until they have an event. Mm -hmm. And the people that are prepared have a minimal effect. The ones that aren't have a terrible effect. Of course. And some never recover. Of course, which so could be. Um, Pretty, pretty damaging, yeah. right? We, I mean, we prefer to educate our customers to make sure that everything that they're doing is effective, efficient, uh, hold their hand in, in any way possible to help them with updating software, best in practice approaches to maintaining their data mm -hmm. and uh, backing up and backing up at multiple locations off site. So that, that's what we really try to do. Very good. So I'm going to ask you to get out your crystal ball now because I'm looking for some predictions. Why don't you, why don't you tell us or tell the viewers um, what um, host.net might look like a year from now? How, how uh, might you guys be evolving? Have fun with this. Sure, sure. <laughs> so, you know, the hottest topic in the market today is security. Security yeah. as a service. Uh, I think that we'll continue to focus on additional security offerings, uh, additional ways that we can help our, our customer base that we've focused on. Our typical customer is highly compliant, requires PCI, HIPAA, mm -hmm. SOC, um, and 
be able to offer them additional products and services that will complement their business, allow them to focus on their business, mm -hmm. and uh, be able to sleep at night and, and know that their data is protected, they're connected, mm -hmm. and they will not have issues. Outstanding. And speaking of sleeping at night, I never sleep particularly well in hotels, but you look you r remarkably uh, refreshed today. Oh, thanks, Dean. <laughs> you, you bet. Let's catch up later tonight, okay? Sounds awesome. Look All right. forward to it. Very good. Thanks for being here. Thanks, Dean. You bet. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We will see you soon.